Thursday, February 15, 2024. First reading. Deuteronomy 30 verses 15 to 20. Moses said to the people, Today I have set before you life and prosperity, death and doom. If you obey the commandments of the Lord, your God, which I enjoin on you today, loving him and walking in his ways, and keeping his commandments, statutes and decrees, you will live and grow numerous. And the Lord, your God, will bless you in the land you are entering to occupy. If, however, you turn away your hearts and will not listen, but are led astray and adore and serve other gods, I tell you now that you will certainly perish. You will not have a long life on the land that you are crossing the Jordan to enter and occupy. I call heaven and earth today to witness against you. I have set before you life and death, the blessing and the curse. Choose life, then, that you and your descendants may live, by loving the Lord, your God, heeding his voice, and holding fast to him. For that will mean life for you. A long life for you to live on the land that the Lord swore. He would give to your fathers Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The Word of God. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Blessed the man who follows not. The counsel of the wicked. Nor walks in the way of sinners. Nor sits in the company of the insolent. But delights in the law of the Lord. And meditates on his law day and night. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. He is like a tree planted near running water, that yields its fruit in due season, and whose leaves never fade. Whatever he does, prospers. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Not so the wicked, not so. They are like chaff which the wind drives away. For the Lord watches over the way of the just. But the way of the wicked vanishes. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Repent, says the Lord. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Reading from the Holy Gospel. According to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples. The Son of Man must suffer greatly and be rejected. By the elders, the chief priests, and the scribes and be killed and on the third day be raised. Then he said to all, If anyone wishes to come after me, he must deny himself, and take up his cross daily and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it. But whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. What profit is there for one to gain the whole world? Yet lose or forfeit himself. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise you Lord Jesus Christ.